the top three entry-level healthcare IT certifications that will help jumpstart your career in the healthcare technology field. If you're interested in landing a job in healthcare IT and having trouble getting your foot in the door because either you have little to no experience or you're switching careers, then keep watching as we review three top entry-level healthcare IT certifications that'll help get you your dream job in healthcare IT. The healthcare industry is catching up and embracing technology like never before. We've seen many changes over the past decade, mainly due to electronic health record systems replacing old paper files and the increased focus towards data privacy. Most importantly, in the wake of the COVID pandemic, healthcare organizations are scrambling to find talent with the right skills and certifications to adequately treat their patient population and assist in the transition from fee-for-service to value-based care. If you find this information interesting, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and smash the like button. Now here are three certifications that'll give you the knowledge and skills you need to succeed in healthcare IT. Number one, the Certified Associate in Healthcare Information and Management System Certification. If you don't have a college degree, this certification is ideal for you. The Certified Associate in Healthcare Information and Management System Certification, also known as the CAHIMS, is typically obtained by candidates who are looking to break into the industry. This certification is best for professionals with less than five years experience working as a system analyst, IT consultant, and even nurses. Candidates should possess a fundamental knowledge of healthcare information systems and the capacity to analyze, design, select, execute, optimize, maintain, and test healthcare information framework. According to ZipRecruiter, a CAH IMS salary ranges from $54,000 to $75,000 per year. Some common job roles for CAH IMS certification holders include health information technology specialist, junior systems analyst, and EHR training coordinator. Number two, the Registered Health Information Technician Certification. The Registered Health Information Technician, or the RHIT certification, shows you are capable of working with quality in mind. This certification ensures professionals have the expertise of ensuring the quality of medical records by verifying the completeness, accuracy, and proper entry into computer systems. RHITs use computer systems to assemble and analyze patient data for the purpose of improving patient care and controlling costs, often specializing in coding diagnosis and procedures in patient records for reimbursement and research purposes. On average, RHIT salaries range typically fall from $41,000 to $53,000 per year. Some common job roles for RHIT certification holders include health information technician, medical records technician, and clinical documentation specialist. Number three, the Healthcare Technology Specialist Certificate. This is a perfect entry-level certificate to display a range of skills. The HTSC certification provides candidates with the ability to address workflow and data collection issues from a clinical perspective, including quality measurements and improvement. They assist in the selecting of vendors and software and advocate for users' needs, acting as a liaison between users, IT staff, and vendors. The average salary for HTSCs range from $57,000 to $70,000 a year. Some common job roles for HTSC certification holders include Health Information Technology Specialist, Implementation Specialist, and Implementation Support Specialist. Careers in the medical health services are expected to grow by 20% in the next 10 years. This projection provides a promising outlook for those who want to pursue a career in healthcare informatics. Well, you've made it to the end of the video. I want to thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed the content. Leave a comment and let us know which certificate interests you the most and any topics you'd like us to cover on this channel. 
And again, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get a notification whenever we drop new content.